Imagine having access to the most powerful language model in the world, GPT-4, but in a more accessible and efficient form. Well, that's exactly what Orca brings to the table. It's like having a smaller yet equally capable sibling learning from the wisdom of its older, more experienced counterpart. And the best part? Orca is going open source, making this power available to researchers and developers like never before. Now, let's explore the fascinating details behind this incredible development. So, what sets Orca apart from its bigger siblings like GPT-4? Well, it's all about striking the perfect balance between power, efficiency, and reasoning capabilities. While larger models like GPT-4 are undeniably powerful, their training and running costs often make them less accessible to many. Smaller models, on the other hand, are more efficient but can sometimes lack deep reasoning skills. That's where Orca comes in. Orca is specifically designed to learn from the detailed explanation traces provided by GPT-4. By tapping into these traces, Orca gains the ability to handle diverse and challenging tasks with remarkable accuracy. It's like having a miniature genius in your AI toolkit. With Orca, you can expect accurate answers and a clear explanation of its reasoning process. It's a game-changer for anyone working with AI models. Now, you might be wondering how Microsoft achieved this impressive feat well. The secret lies in a technique called imitation learning. Orca learns to imitate the reasoning process of large foundation models like ChatGPT and GPT-4. By leveraging rich signals from GPT-4, including explanation traces, step-by-step -step thought processes, and complex instructions, Orca elevates its capabilities to a whole new level. To ensure progressive learning, the development team behind Orca utilized large-scale and diverse imitation data. They carefully selected and sampled from this vast dataset, allowing Orca to surpass existing instruction-tuned models by a significant margin. In fact, in complex zero-shot reasoning benchmarks like Big Bench Hard and AGI Eval, Orca outperformed other models by more than 100% and 42%, respectively. The success of Orca brings forth a crucial question. Can an AI model supervise and control its own behavior? Recent studies by Bai et al. have shown promising results in this direction. By fine-tuning the model based on revised responses generated by the model itself, behavior can be controlled more effectively, making AI safer and reducing the need for extensive human labeling. However, Challenges still persist in instruction tuning smaller models. While they can produce content similar to their larger counterparts, they often fall short in reasoning and comprehension skills. But Orca's arrival marks a turning point. It showcases the potential of learning from step by step explanations, whether generated by humans or more advanced AI models, as a promising direction to enhance model capabilities and skills. The impact of Orca extends beyond the realm of research and development. Large foundation models like ChatGPT and GPT-4 have already achieved remarkable zero-shot performances on various tasks, even surpassing human-level performance on professional exams. With Orca, we're witnessing a new era where smaller models can bridge the gap in reasoning and comprehension skills, making AI more accessible and powerful than ever before. So, whether you're a researcher, a developer, or just an AI enthusiast like me, Orca is a game changer that brings us one step closer to unlocking the true potential of AI. Stay tuned as we keep you updated on the latest developments in this groundbreaking technology. That's it for today's video, folks. If you found this information as mind-blowing as I did, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more exciting updates on AI and technology. Don't forget to leave your thoughts and questions in the comments below. Until next time, keep exploring, keep innovating, and I'll catch you in the next video. Take care!